All right, all right, all right. Well, it's been a it's been a while, and the tack cage is <laughs> filling up. We got Chris Vectors. We've got uh, G and G armament kit. We've got custom build kit. Learnt my way around the airsoft game. Novrich stuff, TM stuff, G and G, Mac tens. GHK, homemade sniper rifles, airy sniper rifles, P90s, a lot of mags, some pistols, nice Novrich number, got that as soon as it came out, the new SSP5, not really ran any game with it yet had one outing in the absolute sodden wet weather with my homemade AAP-01 carbine kit with a drum mag on it and it was just awesome it was just awesome this thing was pretty good as well for the first tune took some long 60 meter old shots with that Novrich SSX-303 uh, SPM-9 isn't it is that what it's called I think it is SMG9, sorry. SMG9 from G&G. &G. Awesome bit of kit. I'm running HPA on most of that stuff. Apart from, I'm keeping this GHK gas. I love the gas blowback effect. Just got some more mags coming. Now this is, I wanted to talk about this. The reason for me putting this update up there is because this is the A&K Chris Vector type AEG and I have to tell you that this I think the first version this is the M2 version got a really bad rap for not being really very accurate to the real thing and being too heavy now don't get me wrong this is still a very heavy gun it's still weighing in at a good five kilos but I am a big guy and not only that but when you shoulder this thing the weight is still far enough back and it really gives some nice weight to aiming it so holding your aim point with a bit of a heavier weight when you're my size is pretty easy 3s battery went straight in here Chris Vector it goes in here and there's not enough space they have some weird extension that you buy doesn't look right um uh, the problem with these is that they are pretty rare and to get the magazines is almost impossible so i have bought another one <laughs> but seeing as that they're half the price of a crytek chris vector i don't care i have to say the ergonomics on it the way it's built the plastics absolutely fantastic i clean the barrel i'm absolutely slamming targets out to 33 meters at the back there um it's got a really nice hop up it's firing 0.28 gra uh, gram bbs beautifully um dead on really really accurate so i can't say enough good things about this um they are really sorry excuse the fingernails i've been painting painting my guns again they it really really is an awesome piece of kit i love it um, doesn't come supplied with the side rails, which is annoying in the front there. You can see where they should go. And it is a 14 millimeter clockwise uh, uh, outer barrel. So you do have to get an adapter, but um, that's not a difficult thing to do. I love it. I really, really do love it. I got nothing bad to say about it and a lot of people did. Um, so uh, yeah, it's running 3S. The Crytac Chris Vectors as well on 3S. I think Patrol Base even have a thing up saying we won't cover any warranty if you've been running 3S. Um, this is, I, I've only run 3S. I've run about 2,000 BBs through it. I'm going to hammer it at the uh, at my battleground and um, and really give it a good run this winter and see how it performs. But so far, after a few days and a couple of thousand BBs, this thing is not.